ഐഡന്റിഫിക്കേഷന് മുന്നേറ്റത്തിൽ കേരളത്തിന്റെ അഭിമാന സ്തംഭമാകും എന്ന് കരുതപ്പെടുന്ന കൊച്ചി സ്മാർട്ട് സിറ്റി പദ്ധതി നാടിനായി സമർപ്പിച്ചിരിക്കുന്നു അല്പസമയം മുമ്പാണ് മുഖ്യമന്ത്രി ഉമ്മൻചാണ്ടി ആദ്യ കെട്ടിടം നാടിനായി സമർപ്പിച്ചത് ഇപ്പോൾ ചടങ്ങിൽ മുഖ്യാതിഥിയും യു എ കാബിനറ്റ് കാര്യമന്ത്രിയും ദുബായ് ഹോൾഡിംഗ് ചെയർമാനുമായ മുഹമ്മദ് അൽ ഗർഗാവി ചടങ്ങിനെ അഭിസംബോധന ചെയ്യും with more than half of the indian population in uae being from the state of kerala our bond have brought us together to be as close as a family and a friend both of our people also share a commitment to openness peaceful coexistence and social harmony that are based in our culture tradition and, and share heritage <clears throat> i would like to take this opportunity to thank the government of kerala and especially his excellency the chief minister and the minister for industry and information and their team for their valuable help and assistance to successfully complete the first phase of this important project this is very important milestone project for the united arab emirates government and for dubai holding today we can see the world in real time without having to sit foot out of our homes talk to people across the world without having to wait for more than a millisecond technology has changed our life what has an able today was seen as a miracle and and the not too distant past with this exceptional jump i believe that what we are witnessing today is the first second of the first hour of the first day of the year of the first year of the technology revolution and the potential ladies and gentlemen it's infinite the literacy rate of kerala is among the highest of all indian state the technological push that we have witnessed in kerala through the past year has also been a strong indicator that kerala will soon become one of the leading destination for technological advancement and sharing knowledge today when we look at kerala and his excellency announcing kerala as a digital state the most advantageous state if you look at the fiber optic in kerala if we look at internet penetration is the highest in india and kerala and if we look at mobile penetration as the highest state in india this is due to a very hard working government but also the education system in kerala been tremendous in pushing the technology because the people of kerala are people who love knowledge and education as kerala is also close to the heart of sheikh mohammed and the people of uae we naturally chose kochi as one of the first location for this unique development today the first phase of this development is coming to reality upon completion this project will be one of the india largest technology park and will attract great investment from the globe This project will be developed as a hub for excellence in the knowledge based industry and we believe that the employment through this project will go beyond 90000 people. A smart city Kochi will become a hub for global knowledge and will share knowledge to the rest of the world from Kerala. While I was walking in a wonderful journalist asked me at this project only are you concentrating in the it sector 
And my answer was, yes, it is a technology city. It is a smart city. But today and in the future, technology will drive the world. It will drive the economy of the world. It will drive the health care of the world. And it will drive the education of the world. So the technology will be a, a base for the economic development globally. And we'd love to have this smart city as the hub of that change. I am also thankful to the previous government for their signing the final agreement to, spit, to uh, start this project. In conclusion, I would like to extend my appreciation also to Mr. Yusuf Ali and Mr. Shams for their help. What we are witnessing today is a great leap in our exceptional relationship. I salute all of you and dedicate this success story to the people of Kerala here in the state of Kerala and also in the United Arab Emirates. And thank you very much. Thank you. സംരക്ഷണത്തിലേക്കും പെട്ടെന്ന് മടങ്ങി വരാം ചെറിയൊരു ഇടവേളയ്ക്ക് ശേഷം